Good morning everyone. It is Saturday and I'm out in the yard right now. Uh, got a lot of yard work to do. We had some trees come down. I had to go out and buy a chainsaw. So I did. Got myself just a cheap electric chainsaw. Got to get these branches cleaned up. Uh, got some cleaning to do throughout the yard. So I'm going to take you guys through it today. Uh, it's supposed to be like the last nice day for a little while. Uh, probably about four or five days. We're supposed to have rain and cool temperatures. So we'll get it all this stuff done today. So I'll probably be dragging Tukas by the end of the day today. Uh, I don't know where the camera's picking it up, but we got the mayflies or the black flies, what they call them. And they're driving me nuts right now. So uh, safety first, got my safety glasses, my chainsaws right here. Just gotta go to the shed, get the uh, extension cord. Let's get this branch out of the way. than I thought it was gonna be. Wasn't supposed to be that warm today. I'm dying right now, so I'm gonna to have to lose this sweatshirt. Oh, man. But, got everything cut up. Now it's just a matter of cleaning everything. And that's the biggest pain in the butt. Oh, so, here you get a quick drink and I'm gonna to get to cleaning this stuff up. I don't have a wheelbarrow. That's what I want the wheelbarrow for. Darn it. All right, let's get this thing cleaned up.
I am officially out of gas. Holy mackerel. Got a lot done today, though. Um, didn't get the grass. Gonna have to cut that. Hopefully tomorrow the rain holds off, but... <sighs> I got over here all done. Just had this pile. But the firewood's all stacked nice and neat now. I gotta chop that over there. Not happening today. We got a fire ready to go. We might have one tonight. With this pile right here. If you burn, if you have like a fire pit or something and you have a desk that you decide not to keep anymore, don't throw it in the yard to burn and forget about it because yeah, it's a mess. It's a big mess. Oh, I still have a lot to clean up from that. But I just had, I was holding the leaf blower and went to put it into the other hand because my right arm started getting tired. These two fingers cramped up as you can see. My hands are so wicked shaky. They cramped like that. I could not undo them. Oh, uh, my wife ended up having to massage my forearm to get them to loose. So, right there, that's telling me tend to take a break. So, alright, I'm going to go in and get some water. Uh, maybe get something to eat and take a break. And I will get back to you guys in a little bit. Alright, everyone. I am done. <laughs> oh, that yard work. Got a lot done today. Uh, I didn't realize it was such a mess out there. But, love my new chainsaw. I just, just saw it's right behind me. Uh, other thing I got. I got a new drill. Went to the depot. And I need a new battery. I already have a battery operated drill. My wife bought me a tool set. When we first got married. Tw almost 20 years ago. And it still works and everything, but you can't find the batteries for them. They're the old nickel cadmium. All the new batteries are lithium. So went to Home Depot, see if maybe I got lucky. And they did have the um, a nickel cadmium battery, but it was $79 for it. Uh, lithium batteries, $79. But the guy told me that the lithium batteries will work in my drill and all the tools that came with it. So I was going to get one and then told me to wait. He said, come over, showed me, show me that. It's a new drill. But it comes with the battery and the charger because for the lithium battery, I was going to have to get a new charger. That was an additional $49. So it's going to be well over $100, actually almost $120 for, for me to buy a new lithium and a charger. This here comes with the drill, a lithium battery, and a universal charger. So I can use it to charge. I have one nickel cadmium battery that still works. So I can use it to charge that also. $49. Explain that to me. <laughs> so I grabbed it. Uh, if you go to the Home Depot in Johnston, we call it the Depot on the Hill. It's the one right off of Route 6 on Atwood Avenue. Uh, gentleman's name is Max in the hardware department. Awesome job, Max. This this guy was, he was incredible. He was incredible. So if you're from Home Depot in any way, shape, or form, uh, give kudos to Max because he did, he did an awesome job. But... I'm going to go and I'm going to jump in the shower and I'm going to try to get a little bit of energy into me to do something tonight. Don't know what I'm going to do. I am so sore. But um, yeah, I'm, I'm going to get cleaned up right now. Hey everyone, that's going to be it for this video. Uh, this is the next morning. I ended up, I went and I sat on the couch and I passed out. <laughs> oh my God, I am not 20 years old anymore. I hurt so bad this morning. Oh God. <laughs> But the yard looks good. I got a lot done out there. Uh, I got a lot more to do, but we'll get it done. Uh, thanks for watching. If you're new to the channel, I appreciate it. Thank you. If you like the video, click right here, the, the thumbs up icon. If you want to subscribe, you can click over here. Click that little bell icon. You'll get a notification anytime I put up a video. Uh, the new chainsaw that I got, I love it. It worked beautiful. Did exactly what it was supposed to do. So I'm happy with that. So thanks for watching. I do appreciate it. And I'll be back to you guys soon.